Well, the Sarah Land teen who was allegedly kidnapped early Friday morning is now out of the hospital and recovering at home. New tonight, her mom and stepfather speaking out about the scary situation to just one station and one reporter today. That was our Tyler Finger now with the very latest. Friday was a very emotional day for friends and family of Raina Tapia. For hours, they had no idea where she was or who kidnapped her. She's now home safe and a suspect is charged with taking her. The Friday morning kidnapping of 18 year old Raina Tapia led to an hours long nightmare for her mom and stepfather. I never thought it would happen to me. It was so unreal, just helpless, just so helpless. It's one of the worst moments of my entire life. Tracy and Chris Taylor are now able to look back at Friday's frantic search for their daughter, knowing that she'll be found alive. Hours after Raina was taken from the parking lot of Troubadour Saloon in West Mobile, she was spotted on the campus of the University of South Alabama. She's doing okay. I think she's still more in a state of shock. You know, I don't think it's really hit her and her friends have surrounded her. More than 12 hours after Raina disappeared, Mobile Police making an arrest. Investigators believe 34 year old Morris Linson Jr. kidnapped the teen. Linson was arrested in Northwest Florida and is sitting at the Escambia County, Florida jail, waiting to be sent back to Mobile to face charges. Hopefully he will cooperate with the police, um, tell them everything so we can get through this. Detectives say part of the investigation is looking into whether Raina was sexually assaulted. Her parents say she has no memory of what happened. Tracy has a strong warning for other young people to make sure this doesn't happen to anyone else. Be aware of your surroundings. This scared me. This scared me. It was my worst nightmare. Look out your rearview mirrors. Pay attention to your surroundings. Raina is resting up after this whole ordeal. As for Linson, he's charged with kidnapping, but he may face more charges. In the studio, Tyler Finger, Fox 10 News.